Hey guys, it's Shannon. I'm outside in the workshop today and I'm gonna show you how to make your own rustic wood star. So let's get started. So first I wanted to tell you a little bit about the template that I made. I just cut this out myself and if you would like to make a star about the same size, you can use the measurements that I'm gonna share with you for this one. But the great thing is, is if you want a smaller star, you can make it smaller, or if you wanted a bigger star, you could up the measurements and make it even bigger. So this uh, diamond pattern that I've made here is seven inches from top to bottom. It is three and a half inches wide here. So if you make a kind of cross, you want it to be seven inches tall and three and a half inches wide. And then the measurements for the shorter angles are three inches long. And then the longer sides are five inches long. So seven inches, three and a half inches, and then these will be three inches and five inches. So I hope that helps a little bit. And it was super easy to do. And I'm just going to use this piece of old pallet wood that I have. I'm going to trace the template on here. I'm going to need five of these diamond shapes and then I'm going to use my miter saw over here to cut them out. to match the angle on my on my diamond shapes so some miter saws have a laser that'll help you out with this my DeWalt miter saw actually has sort of a shadow that it casts so I can see right where my blade is gonna go down through the wood so I'm just adjusting the angle until my shadow lines up with the angle on my pattern and that's where I'm cutting So now it is time to put all of our five diamond shapes together. So all you have to do is put your shorter points together in the middle like this so that your taller points of the star are sticking out around the outside. And then I'm just going to be using my Craig jig to make some pocket holes, which I can show you I did one here. So it's just a pocket hole on the back into another one of the diamond shapes and it pulls it tight. And then it is nice and secure. So I'm gonna do that to the rest of them. <laughs> 